Utility crews are around the state are working to restore power for hundreds of thousands of people. Governor Rick Snyder is calling Wednesday's high wind outages the biggest combined power loss event in the state's history. Here's a look at the latest numbers from utility companies in mid-Michigan. The Lansing Board of Water and Light is reporting just over 2,000 customers are without power as of right now. The BWL says all customers should have their power restored today. As of this morning, Consumers Energy is reporting 101,000 customers are without power, and that is for the entire state. Consumers says some people may be without power until Sunday. DTE is also working around the clock to restore power for their customers. They say 800,000 have been affected by the wind damage. Initially, the company reported this was the second largest outage in their history, but they're now saying this is the largest outage they've ever experienced. Hundreds of thousands of DTE customers are still without power. The company says they're working on restoring power to hospitals and police stations first before working on residential neighborhoods. Which customer will get restored and exactly when is going to be a moving target for us for a couple days. So while I'm confident that we'll get to that 90% on the end of the day of Sunday, right now it's really hard to say exactly who's going to get restored and when. DT also says there are about 4,000 down power lines and 650 extra crews from out of state helping with the restoration effort.